hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are old here thanks if you are new here please kindly subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified when i upload a new video in this tutorial i'm going to show you how to design a church flyer using photoshop before any further i do let's get started in this tutorial i'm going to use 4 by 4 inches then leave the resolution at 300 you click on create So here are my background, import this image, then scale it this way, go to your Gaussian blur, enter 27.7, then bring this image again. Then you scale it this way then select linear light then leave your opacity at 35 go to your Gaussian blur enter 10.0 then apply your layer mask then make sure your own is like this you can see then make sure it is like this then you click ok then on this place select multiply then you blend over here then import this image leave it like this decrease the opacity then you blend it over here now I'm going to copy this text select your text to ctrl v to paste Duplicate it, change the color to white, come over here to copy your text, Ctrl V to paste, alright, Then apply vertical alignment, Ctrl D to deselect. Then come over here again to copy this one. Select your test tool, then you paste. scale it out circle like this then I'm going to copy this one select your test tool ctrl v to paste I'm using the font railway. I'm going to close the character space. 
Then come over here to copy again. Select your test tool. Then you paste it. Then I'm going to change the font to papers. Arrange the character space. Position it over here. Then you scale it out. It's okay. Then you close the character space a bit. Then you copy this test. I'm using the font dashboard. Then re reduce the font size. We position it over here. Then you come over here to copy this one. Then paste. Scale it out. Then open it this way. Position it like this. All right. Okay, then I'm going to use this color code. Then Ctrl V to paste. So now I'm going to apply testing effects. Go to your inner glow. Then you use this color code. I'm going to leave it this way. Enter the code you are seeing. Then I'll leave this one at white. So input all the number you see in this test effects. So you can see, then you click OK. And enter the same thing here. Then click OK. Then I'm going to copy it. Then I'll paste this over here. Then you copy your test again, select your test tool, Ctrl V to paste. Then change your font to real well. Reduce the font size. Then change the font color to orange color. Then apply drop shadow. Mm -hmm. 
אוקיי. All right, I'm done with the grouping. So the next time I'm going to draw a red angle over here. Then apply this color. Also draw another shape over here. And change the color to white. Then increase the round shape. So like this. Then I'm also uh, going to apply a rectangle design over here. Then change the color to orange color. Then I'm going to duplicate this one. Before then, I will arrange this one properly. Then increase this one this way. Then I'm going to duplicate it. Then drag it over here. Right, we are done with the arrangement. I'm going to bring this image, then scale it out. Then bring this one also. All right. Now I'm going to apply brightness and contrast. Okay. things okay like this then come over here to copy your test change the fonts then you paste it then reduce the font size then take it over here I'm going to shift this test up so that I will have a specs. Also scale this one up. All 
all right i'm going to duplicate this one drag it down then come over here to copy your test again then you paste it reduce the font size and position it over here Then duplicate this one again. Then you drag it over here. Then come over here to copy your test again. The control V to paste. Position it this way. Then copy again, Ctrl C. Then you paste your test again. Then arrange it properly. All right, we are done with the arrangement. So move it over here. Apply skin file now to smoothing the image. So I am now I'm going to copy again. Then you drag this icon. Position it around the end. Then you reduce it. Then press Ctrl U on your keyboard. Select your test to the you paste the test you copy all right. So you position it over here this way then come over again to copy your test then ctrl v to paste change the color to white then you position it over here Then duplicate this one, drag it this way, copy your test again, 
Ctrl V to paste. Then copy this one. Then duplicate this one. Bring it down. Then Ctrl V to paste. Then scale it out to be in line with the other one. Then you drag this one down to be in line together. All right now draw a circle at the center here select your test tool and type this later change the color to black then close the character space a bit then you reduce the font size and position it at the center here. Apply vertical and the horizontal elements. Then I'm going to change this letter to September in short form. Then I'm going to correct it here so that you won't make a mistake while using it. Then also copy this text here. Then bring this icon. Reduce the size. Control U on your keyboard. Select your test tool, then you paste, then change the font to dashboard, then you reduce the font size, Then you copy this one again, then duplicate this one, then you paste it, scale it out, then change the font, drag it down. Then come over here to copy your test again. Then Ctrl V to paste. I'm going to cut out this one. Then now duplicate the test. Then now you paste the one you cut out. Then change the font color to white. Then you also drag this icon. Then 
control u the same way we have been doing then you copy the location select your text tool then you paste change the color to this color and the font to this font here then you reduce the font size so that is it i'm sorry if i'm very fast in this tutorial i'm trying to make the time quick so thank you so much for watching if you are new here remember to subscribe like and share thanks so much so here is the outcome of the design